Neuroinformatics, Wikipedia article audio. Neuroinformatics is a research field concerned with the organization of neuroscience data by the application of computational models and analytical tools. These areas of research are important for the integration and analysis of increasingly large volume, high dimensional, and fine grain experimental data. Neuroinformaticians provide computational tools, mathematical models, and create interoperable databases for clinicians and research scientists. Neuroscience is a heterogeneous field, consisting of many and various sub-disciplines. In order for our understanding of the brain to continue to deepen, it is necessary that these sub-disciplines are able to share data and findings in a meaningful way. Neuroinformaticians facilitate this. History The International Neuroinformatics Coordinating Facility Society for Neuroscience Brain Information Group Collaboration with other disciplines Research programs and groups Australia Canada Denmark Germany Italy Japan The Netherlands Pakistan Switzerland United Kingdom United States Technologies and Developments Notes and References Bibliography Books Journals Neuroinformatics stands at the intersection of neuroscience and information science. Other fields, like genomics, have demonstrated the effectiveness of freely distributed databases and the application of theoretical and computational models for solving complex problems. In neuroinformatics, such facilities allow researchers to more easily quantitatively confirm their working theories by computational modeling. Additionally, neuroinformatics fosters collaborative research an important fact that facilitates the field's interest in studying the multi-level complexity of the brain. There are three main directions where neuroinformatics has to be applied. In the recent decade, as vast amounts of diverse data about the brain were gathered by many research groups, the problem was raised of how to integrate the data from thousands of publications in order to enable efficient tools for further research. The biological and neuroscience data are highly interconnected and complex, and by itself, integration represents a great challenge for scientists. Combining informatics research and brain research provides benefits for both fields of science. On one hand, informatics facilitates brain data processing and data handling, by providing new electronic and software technologies for arranging databases, modeling and communication in brain research. On the other hand, Enhanced discoveries in the field of neuroscience will invoke the development of new methods in information technologies. Starting in 1989, the United States National Institute of Mental Health, the National Institute of Drug Abuse and the National Science Foundation provided the National Academy of Sciences Institute of Medicine with funds to undertake a careful analysis and study of the need to create databases share neuroscientific data and to examine how the field of information technology could create the tools needed for the increasing volume and modalities of neuroscientific data. The positive recommendations were reported in 1991. This positive report enabled NIMH, now directed by Alan Leshner, to create the Human Brain Project with the first grants awarded in 1993. The HBP was led by COSLO along with cooperative efforts of other NIH institutes, the NSF, the National Aeronautics and Space Administration and the Department of Energy. 
The HPG and grant funding initiative in this area slightly preceded the explosive expansion of the World Wide Web. From 1993 through 2004 this program grew to over $100 million in funded grants. Next, Koslo pursued the globalization of the HPG and neuroinformatics through the European Union and the Office for Economic Cooperation and Development, Paris, France. Two particular opportunities occurred in 1996. The two related initiates were combined to form the United States Proposal on Biological Informatics. This initiative was supported by the White House Office of Science and Technology Policy and presented at the OECD MSF by Edwards and Koslo. An MSF committee was established on biological informatics with two subcommittees, 1. Biodiversity, and 2. Neuroinformatics at the end of two years the Neuroinformatics Subcommittee of the Biological Working Group issued a report supporting a global neuroinformatics effort. COSLO, working with the NIH and the White House Office of Science and Technology Policy to establishing a new neuroinformatics working group to develop specific recommendation to support the more general recommendations of the first report. The Global Science Forum of the OECD supported this recommendation. This committee presented three recommendations to the member governments of GSF. These recommendations were The GSF Neuroinformatics Committee then developed a business plan for the operation, support and establishment of the INCF which was supported and approved by the GSF science ministers at its 2004 meeting. In 2006 the INCF was created and its central office established and set into operation at the Karolinska Institute, Stockholm, Sweden under the leadership of Sten Grill Lehner. Sixteen countries, and the EU Commission established the legal basis for the INCF and program in international neuroinformatics. To date, 18 countries are members of the INCF. Membership is pending for several other countries. The goal of the INCF is to coordinate and promote international activities in neuroinformatics. The INCF contributes to the development and maintenance of database and computational infrastructure and support mechanisms for neuroscience applications. The system is expected to provide access to all freely accessible human brain data and resources to the international research community. The more general task of INCF is to provide conditions for developing convenient and flexible applications for neuroscience laboratories in order to improve our knowledge about the human brain and its disorders. On the foundation of all of these activities, Huda Akil, the 2003 president of the Society for Neuroscience established the Brain Information Group to evaluate the importance of neuroinformatics to neuroscience and specifically to the SFN. Following the report from BIG, SFN also established a neuroinformatics committee. In 2004, SFN announced the Neuroscience Database Gateway as a universal resource for neuroscientists through which almost any neuroscience databases and tools may be reached. The NDG was established with funding from NIDA, NINES, and NIMH. The Neuroscience Database Gateway has transitioned to a new enhanced platform, the Neuroscience Information Framework. Funded by the NIH Neuroscience Blueprint, the NIF is a dynamic portal providing access to neuroscience-relevant resources from a single search interface. The NIF builds upon the foundation of the NDG, but provides a unique set of tools tailored especially for neuroscientists, a more expansive catalog, the ability to search multiple databases directly from the NIF homepage a custom web index of neuroscience resources, 
and a neuroscience-focused literature search function. Neuroinformatics is formed at the intersections of the following fields. Biology is concerned with molecular data, medicine and anatomy with the structure of synapses and systems level anatomy, engineering electrophysiology, brain imaging, computer science databases, software tools, mathematical sciences models, chemistry neurotransmitters, etc. Neuroscience uses all aforementioned experimental and theoretical studies to learn about the brain through its various levels. Medical and biological specialists help to identify the unique cell types, and their elements and anatomical connections. Functions of complex organic molecules and structures, including a myriad of biochemical, molecular, and genetic mechanisms which regulate and control brain function, are determined by specialists in chemistry and cell biology. Brain imaging determines structural and functional information during mental and behavioral activity. Specialists in biophysics and physiology study physical processes within neural cells neuronal networks. The data from these fields of research is analyzed and arranged in databases and neural models in order to integrate various elements into a sophisticated system, this is the point where neuroinformatics meets other disciplines. Neuroscience provides the following types of data and information on which neuroinformatics operates. Neuroinformatics uses databases, the Internet, and visualization in the storage and analysis of the mentioned neuroscience data. The main technological tendencies in neuroinformatics are In order to organize and operate with neural data scientists need to use the standard terminology and atlases that precisely describe the brain structures and their relationships. Another approach in the area of the brain mappings is the probabilistic atlases obtained from the real data from different group of people, formed by specific factors, like age, gender, disease etc. Provides more flexible tools for brain research and allow obtaining more reliable and precise results, which cannot be achieved with the help of traditional brain atlases. The first was the existence of the U.S.-European Commission Biotechnology Task Force CO chaired by Mary Clutter from NSF. Within the mandate of this committee, of which Koslo was a member the United States European Commission Committee on Neuroinformatics was established and CO chaired by Koslo from the United States. This committee resulted in the European Commission initiating support for neuroinformatics in Framework 5 and it has continued to support activities in neuroinformatics research and training. A second opportunity for globalization of neuroinformatics occurred when the participating governments of the Mega Science Forum of the OECD were asked if they had any new scientific initiatives to bring forward for scientific cooperation around the globe. The White House Office of Science and Technology Policy requested that agencies in the federal government meet at NIH to decide if cooperation were needed that would be of global benefit. The NIH held a series of meetings in which proposals from different agencies were discussed. The proposal recommendation from the U.S. for the MSF was a combination of the NSF and NIH proposals. Jim Edwards of NSF supported databases and data sharing in the area of biodiversity, Koslo proposed the HPG as a model for sharing neuroscientific data, with the new moniker of neuroinformatics. Molecular and cellular data, data from organs and systems, cognitive data, developmental information, information about diseases and aging neural engineering data, and computational neuroscience data. Neuron tracing and reconstruction is an essential technique to establish digital models of the morphology of neurons. Such morphology is useful for neuron classification and simulation, 
BrainML is a system that provides a standard XML metaformat for exchanging neuroscience data. The Biomedical Informatics Research Network is an example of a grid system for neuroscience. Burn is a geographically distributed virtual community of shared resources offering vast scope of services to advance the diagnosis and treatment of disease. Burn allows combining databases, interfaces, and tools into a single environment. Budapest Reference Connect Home is a web based 3D visualization tool to browse connections in the human brain. Nodes and connections are calculated from the MRI datasets of the Human Connectome Project. Geneways is concerned with cellular morphology and circuits. Geneways is a system for automatically extracting, analyzing, visualizing, and integrating molecular pathway data from the research literature. The system focuses on interactions between molecular substances and actions providing a graphical view on the collected information and allows researchers to review and correct the integrated information, Neocortical Microcircuit Database. A database of versatile brain's data from cells to complex structures. Researchers are able not only to add data to the database but also to acquire and edit one, Sense Lab. Sense Lab is a long-term effort to build integrated, multidisciplinary models of neurons and neural systems. It was founded in 1993 as part of the original Human Brain Project, a collection of multilevel neuronal databases and tools. SenseLab contains six related databases that support experimental and theoretical research on the membrane properties that mediate information processing in nerve cells. Using the olfactory pathway as a model system, BrainMaps.org is an interactive high-resolution digital brain atlas using a high-speed database and virtual microscope that is based on over 12 million megapixels of scanned images of several species, including human.